Welcome back to Final Fantasy Tactics Advance 2. Oh, I wanted to see... Do we have the answer for this quest? Yes. We'll pick up two side quests right away. To go do... Oh, this one's interesting. Sorry, I'm very distracted. Item recovery, but that might be difficult. I want to do this one. Silawa the Gluttonous, because I finally have the item for it. I've thought up a new formula I'm eager to put to the test. I'll need someone to bring me a fresh rat tail for the mixture. By Silawa or Kilawa the Gluttonous. I finally have a rat tail, so I have to go to Kamoa for that. I noticed that when I was doing... Uh, I was at the bazaar... And I could have traded it in for an item, but then I realized, oh no, wait, I need this. And the moon seal. Remember when we did the star seal? This is the follow-up to that quest. The stone with no name was no mere stone. What wisdom did the ancients leave for us to find? I'll need to know more in order to decipher their message to us. The legend tells of three seals. I want you to try the second, known as the moon seal. And this one is also at Kamoa. Okay, we'll go ahead and deal with these. Come on. Oh, they're perfectly in the order I want to do them in. He's a little new mo. Hmm, brought a rat tail for me, have you? It's for a potion. I'm an apothecary by trade, you see. Sadly, many of the ingredients we use are so delicious, they never reach my mortar and pestle. I see. That red tail does set my stomach rumbling. Let me take it off your hands. Not so fast. I didn't go to all this trouble to bring you a snack. I'll give it to you, but you have to promise to use it in your potion. Oh, my new mixture. I had completely forgotten. Of course, of course. I'll just... Mm, grr, grr, grr. Ah, I've done it again. Perhaps I'm just not cut out to be an apothecary. I think I'll try a new line of work. A clan like Culinary Crusade may be more to my uh, taste. Well, at least we're helping him find his path in life, I suppose. And then the moon seal. <clears throat> Pardon me, thank you for coming. Will you press the moon seal to the stone with no name and discover its true nature? I assume this will be very similar to last time. Sure, just give me the seal and I'll go check it out. I'll have to do a battle. Perhaps two in a row. There's this... Uh, Stone. We cannot use lightning. This is fine. Oh, did I show you yet? I made him a time mage. Yeah, yeah, I did that last episode. Eggle. He can haste people. It's very useful. Ney is a white mage because she's still learning... Look at equip units. She's still learning Cura. I need her to have a second white mage ability. She's like halfway there. And then. Loesh. Nate. And. Well, here's a question. Black mage. Yeah, I'll use my dream team. Like, I have these weaker units that I really need to be able to use. I need to find some way to be able to bring them in. Speed up or power up. Use power. There's an odd looking stone by that monster. Maybe that's the stone with no name and one of the guardians. Leave out of our sight. Kind of a strange choice for a guardian. Well, let's go try the moon seal. Come 
comments. What can you do? I gave you red magic, so... She can do some damaging magic. Adele, you also go that way. And, oh, we also have, you have you being able to do lots of magic. There should be nothing difficult about this fight. Because they're lower level and there's only three of them. But then we have to do another one as a follow-up right after this. I render. Their evasion seems very high. Well, and their speed, obviously. Nate, you can't really do anything. Just move. Um, what if I... I have such limited range on haste. If you throw it on Loche, it's already his turn next, so it's not the most strategic move here. Just you leave this to me. Mind the carnage. Wouldn't want you getting hurt. Ha ha ha. Battle shout. Resilience. This is the way, eh, to victory. Sure, bro. And you get to go again, at least. Yeah, I want to see. 67 points when you do a normal attack. That's very good. Air render, though. 73. Just ever so slightly better than normal attacks, it seems. You just move up. Fire. And if Adele connects, then this guy's already gone. Just move up. Like magic. Also throw a fire in there. And one KO. Supersonic wave. Oh, what does that do? I forgot. Just damage? Because I have no problem with that. I have him with white magic equipped. But I probably should give him blue magic. Um, yeah, I'll move up. Haste fades. See, wow, that's quick. Oh, you're... Finish him off. I don't recall if I did this on camera, but I also went through the trouble of ensuring that Nate knows Magic Hammer, which is a blue magic spell. I just think it's a really bad spell in general. But I was like, well, if I can, if I can get him to learn it, that's another spell he knows. I just kind of wanted to collect them all. I'm not exactly sure how it is in this game, but in the first game, there's definitely some that are missable. Mostly because there are certain mobs and... How would you say it? Uh, mobs that are monsters that are not their upgraded version that you only encounter in the beginning. And then you mostly encounter more upgraded versions later on.
I don't have to defeat that guardian to beat this map, but it does give me extra XP, so I will. I will do that. And he's more damage resistant than the others. Can I hit him yet? No. I seem to recall from the first game that there are like these gnome creatures in the very first mission or so. And there's only very few early on missions that you fight them. And those are your only opportunities to learn stuff from them. And they are like the back Nemi here where they have magic hammer and goblin punch. What white magic do you know, Kira? Okay. The shell and protect also count as white magic powers. Well, looks like this is it for you, buddy. KO. Why don't you cast some magic on yourself? And now everyone's at full health, I believe. I shouldn't even move them up. I should just skip their turns. Oh well. Losh, you get to do the honors. Examine. The stone's reacting to the moon seal. What kind of screen do we get? Complete. A couple people leveled up. And then we should get a new area unlocked, just like the last time. Oh, it's a copy of the first one. It's, a, I guess it's like a ruined ancient temple just like the first one attacks with rods staves poles knuckles hammers and maces are forbidden bludgeoning weapons so we cannot do melee attacks with our mages oh we'll pick power up again looks like we've wound up in yet another place okay so this is the hidden land which the guardians watch over not a bad place, really. Leave. This must be the Guardians. Something tells me we're not very welcome. You kill all of you. Let's deal with these monsters, then worry about where we are. Can you really blame them, though? We hurt their friends and barge in. Chubo. Bulbu. They have odd names. Magic. I could stand back one further. No, this is fine. I'll stand all the way forward, which will mean I take damage. But I can hurt two of them at the same time. Very good. I also kept... Uh, the fact that I had a lot of MP saved up. And you do it again. There, that's pretty good. You're just a soldier. Move up. Aaron, or can you reach? No, I didn't think you would be able to. No, you're also too far away. Yeah. Oh, 
on guard. I also wonder how often I'm going to be able to encounter these werewolf guys. Time magic. Los, you need to be faster. I wonder if that's just a Templar property that he is strong, but he is very slow. Oh, and I noticed, by the way, this time, you look at this creature. It is an even further upgraded. Lamia. These are already the upgraded ones. I think they can be blue, red, yellow, and now brown. Doom and charm. That's not just doomed. I can't heal that. So. No, 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 no. I do need to move forward. And then you just need to wait. Just stand there and wait. So, not thrilled about getting doomed. I guess we just have to try and destroy them all before that goes off. Again, regular attack, 51 points. Not bad. Air render, however, 57 points. Okay, there goes my first turn. 60 points, but he also can air render... 78, that's a big difference, actually. Almost 50% more powerful on paper. Black magic. Oh, this hits three of them. So I'm gonna go for that. And otherwise I'll have him stand still. Two with HP critical. Well, why don't you also just hit three of them, if you can. That's two down. And you... Two of them. So you are being efficient. Okay, what kind of scary abilities do you have, if any? <laughs> we won't get to see them yet, I guess. Counterattack. Oh, yeah. Oh, that heals her because it's a dark blade. No. Air render. 54, 57. Oh, that could be a one hit KO. So, we'll do that. Nice, nice. What do I want to do with Eggle? You have lots of MP. Play Zara? Yeah, why not? Nice. Can you attack this guy? It'll be one hit KO. Well, <laughs> down at his current HP. Critical hit. Like it. Uh, you have 98. We should be able to take care of that with our two mages here. You move up. And you're allowed to use Thunder now, so... 20 na half damage thunder. Okay, no, no, no. We don't want to do that. 
58. See, that's the kind of numbers I like to see. And then you actually roll high for damage. Move up. Good magic. Are you? Yeah, also half damage for lightning, so we won't do that. Actually, I think we cannot defeat her with just these two. With one upgraded spell, so try that. Yeah, no, she'll be on low health, but... That's still good. I'm so glad that doesn't trigger counter. <laughs> Doom and charm. Because if it triggered counter, she's a mage right now, she has a, a rod. She would attack back with a rod. That would count against... Uh, against our rule, that's our current law that's been laid out. You move and you air render. That's good. You won't get counter-attacked, and you do good damage. Our Time Mage. Oh, you can finish. You can... Yeah, KO. Very good. It's better than I was hoping. You go here. You can't actually do anything, but... You could damage all her MP. That's cool. And you get to finish it off now. All right, no one died. We'll let Mari do the rest of the investigating. They leveled up, Eggo leveled up. Everyone's level 20 or above now in this party. Success. Someone who wants to join the clan, maybe. Let's see. Life in your clan seems rather pleasant. Might I join? Another Viera. And you're already a red mage. I don't know if these stats are any good. You're level 17. It's not high. I'll take you in for now. Excellent. I won't let you down. You better not. The stinger does that. Yeah, teach you shoe. Thunder. It's good. Give you a good robe. A wizard's hat. And that's all we can afford for right now. And who knows, maybe we'll see you blossom into something. 